Brought to you by Paul Cigars, three convenient locations in the Portland metro area. Uh, we were talking about his first time here. Can you tell me, uh, in 14 years, good lord, do you remember the first story you ever covered, the first story you did? Uh, well, I remember one of the first stories I did. Sure. Yakima. Yeah, anyone been to Yakima? Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Uh, and it was on a Future Farmers of America convention. And yeah, very Boy, exciting. howdy. Now, were you, very well, exciting. what news channel were you working for? It was an NBC affiliate there, KNDO. So, uh, KNDO? Yes, but I, but I was by myself, so you shoot by yourself, you edit by yourself, you do everything by yourself. Yeah. So wow! I, so I went, Take that, graphics guy! Uh, <laughs> so, no, I went, and there was a kid, I thought, well, how can I make this interesting? There was a kid who made a pig inseminator, and I thought, that was really interesting. You know, they, they've done that story on me, yeah, I, but I, I, I was the pig and it was my inseminator. Randy! <laughs> so no, I did my whole story on this and put it together. I was very proud of this plastic tube thing. And my boss wrote me a note afterwards and said, Jenny, what were you thinking? This was a plastic pig penis. And people were watching as they ate dinner. So hey, high five. That's great TV. That's great TV. You ran Hood to Coast recently. I did. I've, I've run a Hood to Hood, which yeah. is a Mount Hood Community College to Gresham, because I had to get away from this meth head. Uh, what was Hood to Coast like? Uh, well, I had to run through parts of... Gresham? Yes. No! Speaking of... <laughs> Springwater Trail. Yeah, that was... A, no! Ah! Yeah, it was scary. But anyway. How many times did people try to shank you and or throw batteries at you? <laughs> there was a lot of sketchy, but then I ran through uh, Kirtlandia, so there were scary times and then hungry times. It was, oh, not, very nice. it was not a good run. Scary <laughs> times and hungry times. Yes, so. uh, it's, uh, wow. yeah. no, it was one of those things where at the time when I signed up six months earlier, it sounded like a good idea at the time. And it's sort of like being on this show. Understand. Exactly. <laughs> Rand? No. No, and then uh, the outhouse lines are epic, and you sleep in a van, and it's uh, not that fun. Well, but... sounds like my life. Yeah. <laughs> you ever hear the phrase, or use the phrase, this just in? I love those old-timey phrases. Mm -hmm. Only at home. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> When we, we do, we do have that a lot in the show. And Jeff Giannola, anyone know Jeff Giannola? Yeah. yeah. He is famous. He's famous, yeah. And I, I sit next to him for about an hour, but he will take the thing off the thing and he'll go do 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 like, you know, old time breaking news. Yeah. Not for air, but that's, um, our, little, that's our little thing. Yeah, because yeah. he, he reported on the Oregon Trail many years ago. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Remember when he was like, Right. Ladies and gentlemen, this just in, right. Grandma has typhoid fever. Just like that, yeah. We lost six oxen, three axles, and a box of ammunition from fjording the river. More than this, if I survive my cholera. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah, that was him. You ever, you ever play the Oregon Trail game? Video game. Uh, no. Have you ever heard of the Oregon Trail video game? Welcome to Reference Town! <laughs>